guys, it's your girl Coco. Welcome back to my channel. Um, so today I just wanted to just run on here. I'm not gonna give you the whole spiel about welcome back to my channel, it's your girl Coco, all that good stuff. But it's not really a vlog style. I did record it in, in my car, but it was shaking a lot, so I just wanted to do it over. So a couple of things, guys. Um, one, I took a half day today, so I can run over and um, get like a mammogram and stuff. And I wanted to talk to the ladies, just a few things about mammograms. And I know sometimes it can be a little scary to go get a mammogram, um, but it's very much so needed, ladies. Um, and I definitely feel that find a place that you're comfortable with um, until you feel uncomfortable, right? Um, the place I go, I've been going to the same lady for like the last five years maybe. Um, and I started going early because they say breast cancer runs in my family because my mom, my auntie, and my grandmother had it. However, the type of person that I am, I'm always thinking outside of the box. So I did get the bracket test and the bracket test came back nothing in my genes, which tells me it's something else. Also in those results, and I got those results in 2013, um, that it doesn't mean that I wouldn't get it, right? So here's my thing, guys. When, when they told me you, it doesn't mean you won't get it, it made me think about the food that we have here and we just know how horrible it is. And that's one of the reasons why I went vegan um, and alkaline vegan at that. So I don't eat certain things. I cheat occasionally, but to be honest, it just, it runs right through me, guys. <laughs> um, but I noticed, you know, with the quote unquote history, my Nana, my grandmother's mother, she was old when she died. And I remember, cause I was a kid, but I remember her dying of old age. So it just made me think about what changed where with my mom, her sister and their mom because my grandmother's sisters didn't have it on their side. So it was just something that it made me think about and it just made me shift a lot of things. So I just wanted to just say quickly, you know, ladies, if you are afraid to go, don't be afraid to go. You just need to know what's going on with your body. Um, just so you can have a relaxing life. Otherwise you'll be stressed out, right? So that's just the first part. The second thing guys is I went to go grab some tissue and stuff from Target. Why is tissue $30? Okay, I recall buying it $20 right before the, the pandemic started. It's $30, guys. And which is telling me that things are quickly shifting. Um, and I know that they are, but if you choose to say, oh my God, everything is so high, you know, it's gonna bother you. But just always say to yourself that you always have enough and above and beyond or more than enough to always be able to have stuff for you and your family. Um, but that was ridiculous, <laughs> $10. Um, so just keep an eye out on that stuff, guys. Uh, I did ask, you know, are we able, cause I, you know, I buy tissue, but I don't like going in and buy like three huge things of tissue. Like I don't need that. Cause inside of one, there's so many. So I'll buy like uh, one one day and one the next day. I haven't purchased more than one in the same day since the pandemic, but they said that I could. But it is going up, guys, so keep eye on that. And also, sanitary napkins, has they've gone up also, guys. Um, from what I saw, it was about 50 cents, 50 to 60 cents they went up. Um, just little stuff that I'm noticing that's going up that I use often. So keep an eye out on that, guys. And that's it for that part. So the other thing I wanted to just come on and talk about was my Invisalign. So this is like a vlog style, I guess, like a vlog. Just chat with me. So I'm on week three, and what I noticed from week two to week three was that the trays are still the same size. Uh, it still seems, I don't know, big to me. I haven't had any pain whatsoever. That first day that I had them, it was like a little bit of sensation, but I don't feel anything. So I don't know, I almost feel like, is it working or not? But who knows, we'll see. Then, um, but I noticed, what I'm noticing now is that the trays are higher. And I'm gonna just, this is gonna be so weird that I'm gonna do this. But the trays are coming all the way up now. They weren't coming all the way up here, now that they are. 
They don't hurt, they're not scratching me or anything like that. Um, they provided a file for it. So the file is cool, I don't need it yet, um, and I'm hoping that I don't. Uh, but other than that, everything is going pretty, pretty good. I change every week, like I said, and um, I haven't had any issues. So when I change my trays, I change them the night of. That way, if it is pain, it's happening when I'm asleep. <laughs> Um, otherwise, I no issues here. I like them so far. I did go out the other day the first time to eat, and that is what I don't like. Um, I don't wanna brush my teeth in the bathroom. I work from home, guys, so it's easier for me. So you guys who are in the office, who have Invisalign, are more power to you, because I know I couldn't do it. So that one time that I went out to eat, it was, it was a bit much trying to brush your teeth in the back. It's just, uh, I don't know. Um, but that's the only issue that I have right now. I'm still gonna keep you guys posted on, on the progress. Um, of course, I don't see any changes yet. However, who knows what's happening on the lower surface. So I go back after tray 10 so they can shave down the center of my what do they call it? It's like, they call it a black triangle, but it's literally like a little small space. So they can close back up again. But other than that, I am okay with them so far, and I'll keep you guys posted on my progress. And that's it, guys. I just wanted to come over here and talk to you guys about mammograms and all that good stuff, and just a quick update on my Invisalign, guys. So I will catch you guys in the next one. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and like this video so people can watch it, even though I'm just rambling on, guys. Um, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.